My name is Fred, I'm 21 years old from Denmark, and I attended the course to be able to participate in the Grind. Well, I heard about the course in, in a news article on a website. So far, they've hosted two courses since I've been here, uh, approximately a month. I didn't really know what to expect. The newspaper was in ferries. I don't speak or barely read any ferries. I, I entered the, the building with a lot of other young, young, um, young guys seeking the, the same course, obviously. I could just freely go in. And, um, and it took place in this cinema hall, a decently sized cinema hall, which was uh, almost filled uh, actually during the course. Predominantly uh, a male audi audience. A good amount of young friend, uh, friend groups attending the, the course. And you would also, it would also be some families actually. And not everyone was gonna use the, the course. I don't think so at least. Uh, some people were there for, I guess, entertainment value or, or something else. In the, at the beginning of the course, we had a brief presentation about the history of um, of the core, of, of the grind, but the, the good stuff uh, was when we we learned we were taught about the regulations of, of the different tools. The there are certain dimensions on the different tools that you that you uh, that we were presented for, and uh, really just how to use the the tools. The land specifically is is quite important. We were shown a video of where to exactly uh, put the lands and. Uh, we were shown videos of, of and, and, and diagrams and, and pictures showing the different tools in use and also how to use them, which then led on to some more uh, basic anatomy of the pilot whale. Take it with a grain of salt, I didn't understand anything. Uh, I, I did this um, mostly because there was a lot of, of, of pictures in the presentation, which was great because I could follow as a Dane. The whole presentation took about an hour. So no practical knowledge assessment at all. Like there were no, ex even just an exam, a test, nothing. It was just one hour strictly theoretical, which is kind of obscene to be fair. Then there was the queue for signing the form, which you would then afterwards could send a, a certificate, like a driver's license. There's a driver's license for killing whales, I guess. A certificate for, for slaughtering whales. I did not have to show any ID either. It was surprisingly easy, let's, let's just keep it that way. It's literally just this cinema filled with people being able to be on their phones and not really listening. I, I was expecting some kind of practical assessment or just something like that, but it was, it was so much easier than, than what I thought. What really, really uh, got to me when the course was, was done and I looked around at the cinema uh, filled with these people now allowed to, to kill, a, to kill the, the, a pilot whale, they could go out on the kill beach with the same amount of experience I had, because there's no control whether who takes the course. With the same professionalism and the same knowledge that I've gained from the course, which is none. This is bound for failure. It's bound for failure in the, in the terms of, 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 uh, of suffering and pain for the whale. You will see several times these participants in the Grind miss their first lance hit and, and try again and try again. So, in conclusion, uh, I, a 21-year-old foreigner with uh, yeah, no way to really understand what was said during the course, is able to, to participate in the Grind and technically uh, kill a pilot whale, which just seems completely crazy to me.